Okay, Taylor, are you ready to see Captain Elliot? <laughs> yes. Okay, take that blindfold off. <gasps> Welcome to Cause Pets, the show where we make the perfect costume for your pet. And this is the lovely Taylor and her dog, Elliot. How's it going, guys? Going good. <laughs> I am obsessed with Elliot. She is such a sweet treat. I would love to know how you guys met and what the story is with her name. Elliot and I met because one of my friends were moving and apparently he just didn't want to take care of a puppy. And I have his dog now and his dog is mine. <laughs> I want a friend like that to give me a dog, though, not to give dogs to. How did you come up with the name Elliot? Well, as a kid, I was obsessed with the, the old Disney movie, Pete's Dragon, with oh. Helen Reddy. And Elliot to Pete was uh, like a source of unconditional love, no matter what hardships may happen in his life. And so when I got my first dog, it was like, that was going to be my source of unconditional love. Oh, girl, you're going to make me cry. This is too sweet. You can tell just in the way she looks at you. She's like, this is my person. Yeah, no, she seems really loyal. But if I'm about to head home from the dog park, she then <laughs> finds as fast as she can another person to be like, I want to stay. And this woman is trying to take me. <laughs> Someone please help me. I need an adult. Oh, my god. <laughs> and it's like, Elliot. I'm Elliot, come on. I'm just trying to leave. She's like, you don't know how hard it is to leave my friend. <laughs> Let's talk about Elliot's talents. Let's see what she can do. Elliot, ready? High five. Oh. Um, lay down. Good girl. Do not oh. fall off. And then speak. <gasps> yes. So what character does Elliot remind you of? Elliot definitely reminds me of my favorite character growing up who was Star Fox from Star Fox I 64. See it. Yes. You do look like Star Fox. Who was my first crush growing up. I mean. And then I found out he was a, you know, fictional character. And then two, he was a fox. I mean, but like, they drew them just so like charismatic and appealing, it's like we wouldn't fall. There's a reason we're all messed up as adults. Yep. Okay, so now that we've gotten to know Elliot a little bit, we know that she is loyal, unconditional love, she's a good girl, and so I'd like to go meet our designer and see what kind of costume we can build for her. Yes. So Taylor and Elliot, I'd like you to meet our wonderful designer, Catherine. Hi, Hi. so nice to meet you guys. Hey, so nice to meet you. Taylor has had quite a history as a cosplayer. <laughs> I'd love to hear a little bit more about your cosplay. So what were some of your favorite costumes that you've done? Like Weasel Hawkeye from Full Metal Alchemist, oh. Evangelion's Azuka and Ray's plug suits. So like the red and the white plug suit. And how about Elliot? Has she ever worn any costumes? We've gone as the captains before. I dressed up as Captain Marvel this year. And so I got her a little Captain America. That's so <laughs> my heart. She definitely looks like a captain to me. Right? She right. totally is. Aw, yeah. oh, that's America's dog. So <laughs> tell me about some of the characters that really remind you of Elliot. I do competitive gaming a lot when it comes to Super Smash Brothers Melee. Oh, awesome. And I play a Star Fox from Star Fox 64. Oh, she's definitely got the right Star right? Fox coloring. Mm -hmm. She looks just like him. <laughs> <laughs> um, also, I really loved Dana Scully. She's oh, awesome. been my inspiration. Jillian Anderson practically raised me. But like that strong, badass, like, Confident, because even though like she's super smart, she's she's pretty silly too. She's yeah. in charge, but she still has fun. Yeah, perfect. And I love the story where how you got Elliot's namesake from Pete's Dragon, and I think that's a really central element that we want to incorporate into the costume. We need something spacey, adventurous, badass. Do you feel like you have enough to go on? I feel like there's more than enough to go on, and I'm really excited. It's going to be possum. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm so excited for Elliot's costume. She kept mentioning a lot of captains, so I think Elliot should become Captain Elliot now. Yes. We're going to have a jacket as the main centerpiece that's going to have the logo of her ship. We're going to have it be called Star Scale. Underneath, we're just going to have a simple shirt that's kind of like a spacey gray. And then we're just going to give her some little accents like a bandana and then a belt. We're going to have some goggles, and we're going to give her a blaster. Why don't I show you how we make some of these pieces? Sounds great. To start with, I've actually drawn our dragon logo. Ooh. So we're just going to have this as the back of the jacket and then I'm just gonna simply cut this out so when I did I also measured the jacket of the space in the back so this way it's not too big and not too short Ooh. so then once you finish off you have your dragon logo Ooh. oh my gosh that looks so good so let's set this aside for when we have our jacket made and to do that let me show you how to make the collar which is gonna be a really important part of our jacket yes so I want her collar to kind of be very like a big presence of Captain Elliot like Doctor Strange's kind of collar that stands straight up Ooh. So to do that kind of trick, I cut another two pieces of fabric that are the same sizes as our two edges of the collar. Okay. And then you're going to just take wire. Boop. And then 
you just glue them to the pieces here. And the reason why I'm doing it on a separate piece of fabric is because when I glue it, sometimes the glue will bleed through fabrics and you oh. don't want that on your finished collar. The only bleeding on Elliot's collar is gonna be the blood from her enemies. Oh, absolutely. So that way it's kind of hidden in there. It's not bleeding through your fabric and it's a nice little hidden texture. It has that additional structure. That is so cool. Exactly. And then when you do that, it oh. looks something like this. So see, there's like these nice wire in here and I can just bend that however I want. It just got that whole like bendability. Oh my God, that's so cool. I love this netting that you put on. It's yeah, so sci-fi. Yeah, it's kind of got like a little scaly texture too. Yeah. And then, then we have our dragon logo on the back for star scale. This is always the scariest part for me. So you have a great, beautiful jacket. You just made it. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to put paint on it and yeah. make it look like it's been through a battle. I'm simply going to take a dry brush and I'm dipping a little bit in the paint and then I'm going to decide where I want. So maybe I want a blaster blast right here. And then we're just kind of dabbing it on in like a circular motion that it's going outward. Because that's where the blast gun hit and it's right. kind of scorching the edges. Yes. And then yes. we're adding a little bit of silver because you know it's space. There's still more space. Yeah. And then if you want to finish it off, you could take a piece of sandpaper mm -hmm. and then just kind of sandpaper and rough and tough the edges a little bit. So Ooh. just a little bit of rough edge and feels like it's in battle to it. Yeah, it really looks like there's been impact. It's just battle scars. Seeing you make this has been a real blast. Let's get Elliot into her costume. Awesome. Okay, Taylor, are you ready to see Captain Elliot? <laughs> yes. Okay, take that blindfold off. <gasps> oh, and goggles and everything! Whoa! Good girl! <laughs> and I love the purple and the green. So for Captain Elliot, I really wanted to have her have this great jacket as the main piece of the costume. Yes. She's the captain of the ship, so of course she has her little <laughs> captain symbol on the side. It says Captain Patch. It's a nice touch. Captain. Um, for the back of the jacket, she has Sorry. her nice large dragon logo. Trying to pull from Star Fox a little bit and the Peach Dragon here. And it kind of says the name of her ship right in the center, so it's Star Scale, so everyone knows that she's the captain of Star Scale <laughs> of course Enterprise. she's the captain. And she needed her own blaster for when she's in battles, so she has her own blaster. The gun and everything. Battles. So you can fill it with water if you want and fight her enemies. <laughs> off with that. And then we have this nice like galaxy colored silver grayish uh, <laughs> shirt underneath and then her bandana. I love this ascot. It's one of my favorite parts about Star Fox 64 is that he has that like bandana and the color scheme is perfect with her cute little ears. Ready to take over the world? High five. Yes. <laughs> Good girl. Well, I think Elliot is ready to blast off into space. We've got more consequence for you next time.